Hey guys, so I just ran into Charlotte Rose real quick to try on some things. I haven't been there in a while, and I've been really wanting a pair of overalls. I did not purchase these because they were $44, um, and I didn't realize until I got home that they were on sale, and I'm super bummed because they were not online. But anyways, they fit really well. These are in a size 24 because you definitely, I always like to size up in these kind of things, and um, they fit really nice. They had a little bit of distressing in the knees. Um, and I'm very bummed that I didn't get them. I may go try to go back and see if they still have them, but probably not because I have the worst luck in the world. But these are a pair of jeans that were on clearance. These are in a size 22. These are the boyfriend's skinny jeans, I believe. Um, I'm not a fan of the wash. It's not my favorite wash and I do not like the seams in the front there. Um, I did like the ankle distressing though. They just weren't my favorite fit. So then I ran into Torrid to try on some stuff, and I'm doing bathing suits in a minute, but I really fell in love with this tie-dye tank top. Super cute. Um, it was not in clearance. It was really expensive. It was like $40, $34 for a tank top, which is out of my range, but I wanted to try it on because I love tie-dye, and I am feeling it this season. Um, this was in a size 2, so it fit pretty well, and I believe the straps were adjustable. Um, this is my type of tank top in the summer. I live in them. So the first bathing suit that I tried on was a little bit too small. I would have sized up to a size three in the top. The bottoms fit fine, um, but they were a little bit big. So I could have done a size three in both of these pieces. Um, it kind of has like a shelf type of, um, bra thing underneath this little ruffle so you know if you're big chested you definitely want to size up in this type of bathing suit I think the bottoms fit great you never want to have too small of anything but I definitely probably would have sized down in the bottoms just in case for swimming purposes that they don't fall off this one was way too small on me the bottoms were fine the top because it is a underwire I would definitely have to size up. I have the worst luck in trying to find bathing suits with underwires. And this little piece kept rolling down or up rather. And um, yeah, it's super cute color. I love the design of it. I love the high-waisted um, ruching in the front there. But the top just kept rolling up. And I would have to size. This was a size 3 and a size 2 if I'm correct. Yes, size 2. So I would definitely get a size 3. And this was a size three and the bottoms fit fine. Focus, thank you. Um, all their bathing suits are on sale right now. I believe they go back and forth between 40% off and buy one, get one 50% off or something. They always have sales. Um, they're still super expensive for my taste, um, but they are really pretty. And they had a lot of cute sets this summer, spring, whatever. Um, so these I just tried on. Obviously, I wouldn't wear these together, but I wanted to try on the shorts and I didn't have any shirts to try them on with. I love that their shorts have this underlay underneath so they're no, you know, rubbing together. Um, super cute. The shorts were in a size three, maybe four. I always like to size up in shorts. And then you'll see the bathing suit top with the bathing suit in a second. There it is. It's my favorite bathing suit I tried on. I am in love with it. I did not purchase it because each piece was like... $45 and I don't have that much money for a bathing suit um, but this bathing suit is actually on clearance right now um, buy one get one something percent off um, it was like 40% off absolutely love it these were both in a size 3 or size 2 I don't remember but that completes this quick try on and tour it if you want more bathing suits comment down below and let me know like subscribe and share as always appreciate it hope you guys enjoyed this video bye